Hello everyone, welcome to Color Designs. Today we are going to learn about Blend Tool. Blend Tool is used to connect a two layer or two shape, join them and make more layers. I use it uh, to make color sets. For example, if I have two shapes right here, I will fill it with one darker color and the other one with light color. As you can see, this is the light blue and the other one is dark blue. Both are, uh, both are with, uh, with the same family of colors. I will select the blend tool and click on the first layer and drag it towards the second one and release it. As you can see, I have a set of uh, colors which has been divided with more layers. These layers has been divided in 20 parts. As you can see, it's been here. Change the number of the of steps in the blend or adjust the spacing between steps. Uh, so I will decrease the point and bring it down to seven, six or seven as I feel okay. I will deselect it and click on it again to bring it a little further to make a distance or um, uh, space between them. So I have this uh, color set for me, so the, if you want more color cells, you can simply change the color after that. You can select a light green and dark green to make a set uh, like this. And you will get a whole set of colors if you want to use it. If you don't have uh, the knowledge or the idea of color combination, you can simply use blend tool. There is another way to use blend tool to make a flower design. I will give you a little uh, demonstration about it. Select a rectangle shape and make a design, flower design. I will click on it and uh, press control and hold it and rotate this shape to make a perfect uh, rotation. I will press control. After that, I will press control Q to make it convert to curve. I will select these three nodes, not the top one, but three other nodes and press delete button. So I will get uh, a little uh, flower shape right here. I will make a duplicate of this layer and make the duplicate a little bit small. Select from the midpoint and bring it down to the other midpoint. I will change its color to dark blue, for example, and the top one, I will make it a light blue. Now I will select the blend tool uh, press from the dark blue and bring it towards the light blue. As you can see, the um, blend tool has been applied on this uh, shape and my design has been created. But uh, the outline on these uh, layers is disturbing my design. So I will press uh, right click on the cross mark to remove my outlines. I will select the whole shape and press Control G to group them. After that, I will click on it. I will move the center towards the intersection point and make a duplicate of it and rotate that duplicate toward right direction. And after that, I will press Control D, duplicate, duplicate. And that's how you use Control D, the way of using Control D, duplicate. I will select the whole shape and make one group. After that, I will press Control D again and rotate the other duplicate to the opposite of this, uh, the first layer and I will make it a little bit small. After this, I will press on the control D. I'll keep pressing it until I get a flower shape right here. I have my design created right here. You can use blend tool to create very useful and unique designs like this one. If you have your own ideas, you can share it. You can make your own designs. This is a simple way of using blend tool. If you have any questions, I will be more than happy to answer them. Kindly leave your comments below. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Have a nice day.